Hi guys, I'm gonna explain an easiest way in which we can convert an image into a printable STL file. I have a picture of a dragon art and I will convert this image into an STL file. So let's start it. First, I will convert this image into SVG. For converting into SVG, I will go to this website convertio.co. The link of this website is given in the description. Then I will click on choose file or I will drag and drop this file on this website like this. Now I will choose a file format in which I want to convert. Then I will click on this arrow, a drop down will open and there are different file formats like DXF, SVG, AI, EPS and so on. Then I will go to the vector menu and then I will select SVG. After selecting the file formats, I will click on convert and you can see now it's converting. You can see the file has been converted successfully and it's ready for download. I will click on download. The file has been successfully downloaded into my computer. This is a dragon file that we have converted right now. Now I will open Film 360 and will create a new sketch on XY plane. For creating new sketch, I will press C from the keyboard and will select the XY plane. Now I will create a circle having the diameter of 30 millimeter. Then I will click on finish sketch. Once the sketch will be finished, then I will click on extrude command and will select the top face and will enter the value 1 millimeter. Then I will select the top face and will create a sketch. Now I will insert the dragon at here. Now for inserting the SVG of dragon, I will click on insert and insert SVG. Insert from my computer and then I will select the SVG file and I will click on open. You can see the SVG file has been opened into the Fume 360 but it's very large. Now I will reduce its size. First, I will rotate this SVG up to 180 degree and will enter the value 180 degree here. Then I will use this handle and will drag to the upward and the size will be reduced. Now I can use this, this arrow to move the dragon left and right or this arrow to move the dragon up top and bottom. I can use this box for moving the dragon in all directions. Then I will fix the position and will increase its size. The size and the position of this dragon has been fixed via these handles. Now I will click on OK. Then I will click on finish sketch. I will click on extrude command and will select this dragon and will enter the value 0.5 millimeter and will click on OK. Now the 3D model of the dragon has been ready. Now I will save this file into a steel file. For saving this file, I will click on inspected body, right click on here, save as mesh and I will select a steel binary and then I will click on OK, I will write its name and this file will be saved to the download folder of my computer and click on save. If I go to the download folder, you can see the STL file has been exported here. If I drag and drop this file into Bamboo Studio, you can see this file is now ready for printing. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe my channel and click on the bell icon so that you can get the notification of new videos. Thank you.